Hello guys, it's Chum Messenger. Today, I have a special unboxing this time around. We have the Death Note complete box set. This is the entire uh, manga right here. Um, with this is such a cool uh, picture right here. I'm not gonna lie, like that. This looks so good. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Man, this has some extraordinarily loud plastic. So by the way, it's like 1.30 in the morning. I'm not trying to wake anyone up. This is just loud. Uh, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to try to open this up very carefully. Okay, the box has been opened carefully. Um... See, I don't know where to even open this thing from. Is it from down here? Where where do I open this from? Is it up here? I'm scared to pull anything. That is sounds like Velcro to me. It is Velcro. Okay, good. I was nervous for a second. Okay, sorry about the like really awful camera angle. This box is just like too big for my uh, setup. And there it is. You can see every single volume. Oh my god. Okay. Um, I've been eyeing this up for like a very long time. And we finally have it. Which is like wonderful. Let's see. How do I even get these books out though? Well, that's the question of the day now, isn't it? Um, hmm. Let's see. Can I like grab any of them to try and make this like easier on myself? Yes, I can. Okay, uh, wonderful, wonderful. So I'm going to go ahead and grab all them out of this box and set them over here. Okay. And then there's this one lone thing here, if I could. And my hands are just, like, gigantic. I cannot, um do anything with these small boxes but inside of there if you can even see that there's a skull let me see if i can actually sorry if this gets like really bright but there we go um phone flashlights right somewhat useful uh, i'll mess with volume 13 or whatever that is in a minute but first let's go ahead and try and show everything else. So the, these are the 12 volumes. Um, so yeah, so we got volume 1, volume 2, and volume 3. These are like really cool cover arts. Are these limited edition or are they normal? I actually don't know. I should check that out. Um, Volume 4. By the way, I just gotta mention this. Uh, Misa, like, uh, Misa from obviously Death Note, she's right here. And a character named Yami from To Love Rue. They look kind of similar, but kind of not. Like, they don't really look that similar. But whenever I play something like Minecraft, you know, I have my Yami skin sheet, because Yami's my favorite character of all time. And the amount of people who who think it's Misa, oh man, it's it's something else. Also, judging by the fact that there's a price down here, I'm going to assume these are not like limited edition covers. I didn't think they were. I just wasn't a hundred percent sure on that. Um, so here's volume five. We have volume six. Volume 7. L upside down there. This, I believe, is the last good volume. Might be. I don't know. I don't. I haven't read the manga, so I wouldn't really know. Just judging off the front parts, though. Alright, we got volume 8. But they do say never judge a book by its cover, so... I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, volume 9... Volume 10. Okay, that's really cool. A 
volume 11. And volume 12. Man, these cover arts, though, like all of them just are so good. The battle ends here. Interesting. Okay, so now I have a giant stack of books over here. Um, volume 13, or whatever this is supposed to be. Can I actually get this out? Yes, I can. This is a thing here. This is how to use it. Oh! This is actually a collect... Okay, this is really cool. This is essentially the Death Note guide. So if you guys have seen Death Note, usually like kind of what would be commercial breaks, I guess, technically. I think that's where it would be anyway. They'll have like a rule of the Death Note appear on screen. I think this is a collection of those rules. Or maybe there's more? I don't know. I'm not going to go through the whole thing because that would take a while. But that is something I will definitely have to check out. And here it is, volume 13. What is this? I have no idea. The Ultimate Death Note Encyclopedia. Right. Oh, never mind. I thought my book was, like, damaged, but it's not. Okay, we're good. Just like a random piece of paper kind of just stuck to it. Um, so this is essentially, yeah, it's like a guide of sorts, um, yeah, it's like an encyclopedia, alright, that's cool, I didn't think, I knew it wasn't like an actual, like, storyline or anything, I was just curious of, what is this, you know, um, so yeah, well, that's what that is, so this is like a really cool box set. Um, I don't think they're that expensive. I've seen them before for like $50, I think, on Amazon. Uh, I don't know. That was probably like 2017 summer. That was a while. Uh, I think they're still around. I did get this for Christmas, and I don't think my parents would spend a ton of money on books. Um, well, maybe. But, uh, I don't know. I, I'd assume these are at least affordable to an extent, especially for the amount you get. It's definitely got to be a pretty uh, good price, I'd assume. Uh, I could be wrong, though. Uh, when I checked and just judging off of that, I would guess it'd be okay. But you never know. I could be entirely wrong. But that's all for this video. Um, this will definitely go well with my uh, light novel with uh, featuring L. Um, I do already have that, so this will be great. Uh, I guess this isn't really an addition to that. That's kind of more of an addition to this, though I had that first. So I don't know what terminology to use with that. Anyway, I don't know why I'm rambling still. So anyway, I'm going to end the video now just because I'm, I'm just going in circles at this point. So thanks for watching and bye-bye.